F.B. Leon Guerrero Middle School has been the focus of much attention from the Department of Education. Its principal and assistant principal are still under internal investigation, and right now parents are meeting with a special team sent in to find answers. Baldo Besic has more. Recommending action, that's what the education response team plans to do at tonight's PTO meeting here at FBLG Middle School. But before tonight's meeting, Beneventi principal and ER team member Dexter Fullo presented their findings to the staff. Fullo says the ERT spent two weeks here on campus of FBLG trying to figure out comprehensive solutions. He says it's not going to be a band-aid covering a bigger problem. So they weren't defensive and they were not um, threatened in any way. It was business as usual and um, they, they did a fairly good job. They didn't put on a show and pony show because we're there. Um, they did everything like it was a day-to-day -day basis. Attempting to get an insider's view, 60 students were selected at random to fill out a 30-question survey of the school, along with 20 teachers and 10 parents. Results were combined with interviews, data research, and performance reviews. Fulo says recommended action tonight will cover five areas. School climate, organization, communication, programs, and protocols. In-depth specific solutions will not be finalized until parents can give input, as well as the FBLG leadership team. The action plan is not just done by the administrator, and it's not just followed by the teachers, but it's followed by the students, parents, and the whole community at large. Fulo emphasizes change will not come without help from the parents. Parental involvement is one of the fundamental, uh, fundamental components needed to, for a successful school. And if they don't come tonight, the ERT will go to them. For Guam News Watch, I'm Baldo Besic. Thank you, Baldo.